Hey, hi. Tonight, I went, I shouldn't say tonight, this evening, I went to the Pilates bar, which is in the Hydrostone of Halifax, and did Pilates. So let's take did lightly. I tried. We went through some like motions and tried a few different things. Nonetheless, my booty is going to be so sore. Ton, Love and Sundays, she's a content creator here in Halifax, put together this event for us there. We did Pilates together. We had some snacks, girl dinner, if you will. We got to make a bouquet of flowers from props. Mine's chilling over there, it's so cute. But we got these goodie bags, and I'm gonna show you what's in it. I didn't go through this yet. I wanted it to be a surprise. First up, we have a shocker. A shocker? No. We have a shaker. What? <laughs> yeah, chill. We have a shaker. It says Niyama. Can never have too many shakers. You would think that you could have too many shakers, but you really can't have too many shakers, especially when your husband uses the shakers. Some eye patches. Grace and Stella eye patches. We love these. It's the Pilates Bar branded candle. It's made here in Halifax by the Burning Flame Candle Company. Oh, that smells wonderful. Also, can never have too many candles. What? Beck's broth? Bear with me. Beck's broth. It is hot chocolate bone broth powder. 14 grams of protein in it. Cool. Gonna try that. We got Niyama Immune Warrior Powder. That, that goes with the shaker. Okay, and then these are our grippy socks that we got. We got these little grippy socks for the Pilates Reformer. Obviously, so you didn't slip. <gasps> the cure oh my god we got face and eye cream from the cure that's what else what else, what else? oh magnesium powder you all know how much i love my serum magnesium united plant protein bar 16 grams of protein chocolate love it the omal face mask oh we're gonna do that my skin's been so annoying I'm so excited about this. This is a light water roller. It's the breathe one. Okay. Mmm, oh, smells so good. Oh, it smells so wonderful though. Surrey and Sydney made us these keychains. And okay, so it has our name on one side. But then I need you to look. She customized them to us. Obviously, this is the curse word. This is for fuck. The weightlifting, the happy face, the cowboy hat, and then the 347. How sweet is that? She did her research before she made us these, and that's so, so special. I need you to see this glass that we got. And tell me this is not the cutest cup you've ever seen in your entire life. I only want to drink out of this forever. I won't lie. I was nervous to try Pilates. You know, there's just some positions that my chubby little body can't get into. And the instructors were so gracious and so kind. They helped us with everything. Their explanations were wonderful. We also got these sets from Aloha and the owner and founder of Aloha actually flew in to see us all in our sets. I'm going to post a video of me in my set. She gave me this burgundy. It basically was the color of my hair, which was so cool. And the fabric was so soft. It fits so well. I didn't even sweat through it. And your girl was sweating. My booty, my booty and my hamstrings are not well, but it was actually so much fun. And I don't think I realized how accessible it was like in my brain pilates is a thin person activity and i think that that just comes from like its roots in dance and watching people take the classes or do the classes or just images that i've seen of it have been thin women or thin people and yeah i did it and it was cool and i would love to go take another class i think i would love to like host a private class we did the warm-up and everybody was very surprised that it was only the warm-up <laughs> which was really funny so grateful for ton because she put it all together the snacks were delicious i'm gonna tag um 
as I share like how the night went, I'll tag all the, the companies that kind of gifted to it for us. But yeah, it was so much fun. And the coaches at um, the Pilates bar were so much fun on top of being very like educational and kind. They were just also just a blast to hang out with. Um, it was so much fun. I love getting to do local stuff because I'm not always home and I don't always get invited. I think that that's just because I'm, people think I'm never home. So it was really nice to be included and get to spend some time with some local content creators here because we have some really, really wonderful ones on the East Coast. Like really, 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 really genuinely, really creative, fun, hardworking content creators out here. And it's cool to just be around them because they just renew your excitement for content creation. And yeah, it was a joy.